What's up everybody, AJ here back in another video. So I'll be checking out Acheron's Keeping Up With Starway video. And based on the quality, the maximum quality is at 1080p. So this video will be rendered at 1080p. Otherwise, if it's um, above, if, it's, if this video is rendered at 4K, then I will render the, the, the video at 1440p instead because I'm trying something new out, so but I, I can't talk about it yet. So, um, let's check this video out. This should be a tutorial uh, video on how how to fully utilize Akron. So, this should be a very interesting one. So, let's not waste any more time and just jump right into it. We have just received an S level one notice from the IPC. S level notice. Akron, female, age, current residence, and home world unknown. Hmm, a kindly member of the Riddlers, perhaps? Akron is the prime suspect in the assassination of several criminals wanted by the IPC, including one high profile case involving a certain Everflame mansion. Boy, she yeah. eliminated one of the criminals and became a wanted criminal? The IPC is seeking help from the public. If you see this person or have any clues like about her, her as a vigilante. please notify us using the comment section at the bottom of this page. The IPC will contact you shortly and reward you with how many credits? Wow, it looks like they're putting a lot of effort on... Uh, <clears throat> to help us explore Acheron the rumors right surrounding here. the enigmatic Acheron, we have invited an eminent soothsayer as today's expert guest. Without further ado, let's welcome Black Swan. Akron keeps oh, a low look, profile it's next and one. operates in the shadows. The IPC doesn't have any clear leads. What approach would you recommend? Stories can deceive, but memories never lie. <laughs> a very Black Swan recommendation. <laughs> now then, let's take a look at the precious memory bubble Black Swan brought us today. I see Akron is a lightning type character on the path to nihility. Mm -hmm. Here we see her reaching into her sleeve and pulling out a... She's pulling out a... Peach? They're clearly putting well, a lot of effort anyway, on uh, Akron's um, keeping up his style. When Akron uses her basic attack, she does lightning damage based on her attack to a target enemy. Yeah, I know that. It wasn't easy getting this memory bubble here. Not going to take a closer look? Oh, uh... <laughs> Rewind. Compared to other characters, Akron has a very unique charging mechanism known as Slash Dream. Yep, when you we all know that during the special Akron program. accumulates a certain quantity of Slash Dream. She then inflicts set stacks of Crimson Knot on a single target and deals lightning damage to adjacent targets based on her attack. That's, that's literally Judgment Cut. Slash Dream, Akron can use her ultimate and then her domain her expansion. Right and draws her sword, casting everything into a sea of darkness and engulfing her enemies in a black hole of terror. Only the color of blood remains. <laughs> that is so cool. I have read countless memories. But only in her memories has all color faded away. She's what? either hot and something, or black and white are her favorite colors. Oh, we'll see. <laughs> Incredible! When using her ultimate, Akron can choose a target for each of her three attacks. First attack three attacks by three, because she has, she has a total of four attacks. And a set number of Crimson Knot stacks. Whenever Crimson Knot yeah, is removed, see, uh... lighting damage is dealt to the target. With Hold on, let me rewind. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Like... Crimson... As you can see, right? There's something like a marker on top of each um, enemy um or on top of their heads as you notice. Like the then I d hold on, let me can I, let me move my head for let me move my head you guys. Let me move my head. So as you can see right over here, right? There's a marker on the left on on, on the dinosaur and then there's like a slash marker on the on the monkey. So yeah. Apparently, each uh, so I think that's pretty much uh, the concept of how it works. Continuing, the knot is removed, lighting damage is dealt to the target with greater damage B. Okay, in for each stack removed. Finally, so that's the, the, the blade, stack. Akron deals lightning damage to all enemies based on her attack while removing all stacks of crimson knot and from the fourth, uh, that is it Even basically AOE. can be cut by that blade. Akron is truly one of a kind. Uh, what's her secret? Let's keep watching. Thanks to her one of a kind talent, when using her ultimate, Akron can reduce Nine, enemy toughness while six, ignoring weakness types three, and yeah. decrease all type res for all enemies. Plus, when any unit on the field, even enemy units, causes an enemy to become debuffed, Akron gains one slash dream and one stack of Crimson Knot. 
All tools are available to use. Yeah, so long story short, right? Regardless of where the the source of the debuff comes from, she will gain a, a stack of the of her ultimate. It could be from her attacks, it could be from her allies' attacks, or it could be from the enemies. As long the enemy is being the buff, she will gain um an she will gain a charge for her ultimate. Including the enemies. <laughs> you said it. Keep what's mine and borrow what's yours. But that's not all her talent does. When an enemy target with Crimson Knight is defeated, that Crimson Knight will be transferred to the enemy unit with the most Crimson Knight stack. As you can see on, uh, on the on the second enemy, the Crimson Knight marker is already has been shifted to the second enemy. It's on the field. If Akron wants to maximize her battle prowess and ability to inflict damage, she's gonna need allies on the field who can inflict debuffs. Know oneself. Yeah. Know your allies and know your enemy. The rain falls on us all. When Akurai uses her technique to enter battle at the start of every wave, I repeat, every wave, she gains a certain amount of slash stream after her next ultimate. Stacks a Whoa, certain every number of not on a random enemy, inflicts lightning damage on all enemies based on her attack, and reduces toughness of all Whoa. enemies regardless of weakness type. And that's not all. If Akron encounters a normal enemy, her technique will vanquish yeah. it without even entering battle. So uh, as you can see, right, yeah, her technique, right, has an instant kill mechanism and it only works against normal enemies. In other words, right, elite enemies, boss enemies and trotters, it won't work on them. You will enter battle instead. But for normal enemies, you, will, you instantly kill them. Battle. And if the hit doesn't land, it won't consume any technique points. Yeah, as mentioned in the, the that Akron has in her the special own program. Way of doing things. Just what kind of person is she exactly? I can show you memories, but interpreting them is up to you. Why are there so many riddles on today's show? It seems yeah, like no matter where Akron, Akron is very mysterious the universe, at this point. Danger is waiting for. After unlocking a specific trace, Akron enters battle with a set amount of Slash Dream and inflicts a certain number of Crimson Knot stacks on a random enemy. When using your skill, they gain a set number of Crimson Knot stacks. When allies use a basic attack against the same enemy, they become inflicted with Burn. Akron gains one point of Slash Dream and the enemy is inflicted with another stack of Crimson Knot. Rewind, rewind, anyway, I'm sorry. Of... So as you can see, right? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm so sorry for doing this, but when when the moment Gwenaifen lands a hit on uh on the dinosaur, right? Keep an eye on on Akron's um icon. It went from six, and then once the land hits, it went to seven. So this is how Akron gains her 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 charge of her slash dreams aka her ultimate point of slash dream and the enemy is inflicted with another stack of crimson knot realizing yeah. the combo they can, they can create with akron's abilities allies inflict a debuff on the enemy triggering another wave of slash dream and crimson knot the enemy tries to get smart with a counter attack but ends up triggering a debuff from akron's ally landing themselves with a stack of crimson knot and granting akron another point of slash dream there you go Ooh, it's ultimate o'clock and akron doesn't the win expansion back. time amid the rain of darkness her blade cuts blood red slashes between heaven and earth <laughs> just like that the enemy is vanquished from this point of existence we're gonna need a bigger ambulance so yeah if you want to maximize um her damage right you might as well target enemies that has the crimson knot stack on them that's the uh, that's I think that's pretty much how to maximize her damage from the way I see it. Because mm, they're dead. As though they never even existed. We learned all kinds of things about Akron. And, uh, well, I've got you. Looking at the year ahead, any chance I can get rich and retire early? That's oh. easy. Wait one moment. Really? <laughs> oh my god, that face. About your hopes for the future, I recommend taking a nap. 
It huh? might happen in your dreams. Huh? <laughs> Nap. I can hardly take a. What the? <laughs> Okay, he clearly said something that he shouldn't say on 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 you on a YouTube video, but this is very educational. Very edu this is very uh, educational, and hopefully this um video clarifies a lot of a lot of stuff regarding um Akron. And speaking of which, right, I would definitely put up um a YouTube video on um uh, maybe uh, on an Akron my Akron showcase. So I don't know how. Long Hopefully, I will get get that up YouTube video up and running as soon as possible. So, do look forward to that. And I think that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it for my reaction to Akron's um keeping up with Star Rail. And um later on, I'll be jump. I'll be checking checking out the the main story for Honkai Star Rail version two point one. So, do uh do look forward to that as well. Well, I think that's pretty much it. So, um, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys have a good one. And don't forget to check out my other YouTube uh, videos. So, my name is AJ and I will see you guys in the next one. Have a good one and peace out.